Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, happy time zone, everybody! This is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road Dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I am a dream usher, so I focus on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can learn to be better versions of themselves, and I am so fucking excited for this fucking game! You have no idea! I have been anticipating this game for like two weeks before its release and then when it came out i was fighting 
so damn hard to spoil myself and try and get through some of the game. One of my littles did in my system, but I haven't, so I'm going in blind. Which is interesting when you say that as a dissociative individual, because it's like, oh, one person in the body has memories of a thing, but you don't. Some people might find that weird. Anyway, <laughs> really hope that, I want, that everyone is doing well. I will let y'all know right now, I have a jam-packed week coming up next week. Namely, thanks to working with Top Hat, because for those that don't know, uh, this is your final, uh, one of your final reminders for the night. Um, Top Hat will be with me on stream Monday, starting at noon, noon Eastern to do a 100% Epic Mickey speedrun. So if you guys want to come over and give Top Hat some emotional support and probably also see him suffer, um, save that on your calendar if you can. Because, ee, I want to support the man. You let the children, you let the children play in this. <laughs> Look, Little Kitty Big City is an, is an okay game. Plus, the one that played it in our system is like, high school age ages and whatnot when it comes to system members make things hella complicated <laughs> baby yeah a little bit <laughs> Wait, you know what let's not waste any more time anything under 25 is baby Hold on, I need to check a thing because right now I know it has mods. So, need to double check a thing. Sorry for the silence. Let me actually turn on the game audio. Let's migrate over this way. Sorry for the violent tippy tap. There we go. Much better. Okie dokie. <laughs> I'm tempted to keep the immersive lighting just because I worked hard on this. But if it does get to be too much, let me know. Um, if things do get too bright and you think it'll be better to not have the immersive lighting on. I can easily do that. You know what? Actually, let's do a quick little test. Light or no light? Light or no light? Which looks better? But which looks clearer? This is now a, apparently an optometry exam. Which one looks better? Number one or number two? <laughs> Why are you testing my eyesight? <laughs> Fuck you, Road. Blame all the ASMR I fucking listen to, okay? <laughs> also, I just realized a thing that I can do. Hold on! I'm gonna look tiny for a moment. Come on, where is it? There it is. And then... Come on. Tablet, work with me. Here we go. All righty dighty. <laughs> All right. Lights. So. Maybe. Lights on. Here we go. All right. You know what? Let's mess with the... Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Larger dialogue text size. That's awesome. Where is Top Hat? Uh, Top Hat... Well... The the whole spiel with uh, Top Hat is not going to be tonight. That's going to be Monday. <laughs> Yo. 
You have him in your card. Derp. Hold on. I can easily just do this. Boom. Problem solved. <laughs> I just have that ready for um, for Monday. Oh, we can change the language in game. Oh, what languages does it have? Uh, traditional, simplify Chinese, English, French, German, Japanese, Korean, Portuguese, and Spanish. Whoa. Star, I think I know another game that we could use for um, uh, Spanish practice. Also, let me turn off the cute box because no one's redeemed it yet. Let me also move it. There we go. Okay. So we'll just keep the English for now. Alright. Huh? <laughs> oh, three save files? Let's fucking go. I'm just so used to, um, oh, I look like, <laughs> there's so much why I look like I'm just being, just blinded. Th this'll pass, this'll pass. Also, why is... Uh, let me tr retry the lighting. Check the prop, the filters. Have it not as intense like that. That's a little better. Um, and then let me actually. And then we shall do. Center. Yeet, yeah, because that completely gets rid of the border in my capture. Yay. Okay. Alright. So. That's fucking adorable, though. <laughs> ah. Where am I? Kitty, kitty! Look at him! Look at him! Look at the body. Look at the little fella. He's a short hair, too. Actually, I don't know the cat's pronouns. Are the cat's pronouns ever going to be established or no? Or do people just not give a shit? Why are you asking him? <laughs> It's a cat. Like in Stray. Alright, you know what? Speaking of... Hold on. <laughs> okay, I think I need to drop this to make him actually... Ch Enjoy the fact that you are a cat. Look at I wish you could do infinite spin. W. I want infinite spin. You ADHD mofo. No shit, I'm ADHD. Hey, Flarg, how's it going? B to jump. This isn't Markiplier where it's B to blow. Doing all right. Through. Doing good. Work was eh. But I'm looking forward to obviously playing this and especially working with Top Hat Monday because we will be doing something very special Monday. And you know, I normally don't stream Mondays. I am working with Top Hat to where we, the, we will be on stream together at noon eastern 9 a.m pacific so that he can do 
his attempt at a 100% speed run of Epic Mickey. Well, 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 if it isn't the flying kitty. Are you talking to me? You know what? I, I gotta do voices. Neat. Well, I don't see any other small cats casually attacking innocent crows in midair. That was you? I'm so sorry. It was an accident. You see, an accident? I... Sounds like you need more flying practice. But I can't actually fly. And you never will with that attitude. Come on. Just flap your wings and follow me. That voice crack was not on purpose. <laughs> I just kept with it for the bit. LOL. Oh. Time to vandalize the artwork after we give him some deceptive nuzzles. Hmm. Hmm. Well, he seems intrigued. You know what? Red, the blood of angry man. <laughs> Let's go. Gotta pull Road. that out of the Could way. we tangent for a moment? Um, like hopping in VC? Sure. Let me, uh, let me hop in a VC. I want to send you a video with a song I want to discuss. Oh? Hold on, let me hop in a VC. Plus, this will actually give me opportunity to grab your, uh, Fuji. Because I lost that with the resetting of my computer. <laughs> okay. Ah. Oh. <gasps> Ball. Ball, 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 ball. Come on. ROA. Asterisk road. <laughs> Focus. I'm in the VC, damn it. I'm just waiting on you, bitch. Jingle some fucking keys. <laughs> What VC? Um, you normal corgi. No normal live uh, RTD VC. Like hell, you can't see me in a server. I'm in my normal live road to death, like RTD stream VC. You just gotta scroll down. There you Even are. I can't see it. There you are. What you mean? The hell are what the hell are you and Flark talking about? Y'all have always been able to see in this shit. Did y'all lose the roll? Do you think I, I know where you would be, but if I'm telling you you weren't in there, I'm telling you you weren't in there. Something's up with your Discord then. You might need to update it. Even Flark can't see it! Then update y'all's Discord! I don't know where to tell you because I've been in here for the last five minutes. <laughs> no, you haven't. Anyway, shut up. Well, We're two minutes. The thing. Well, Hold on. I'll have I'm to share my screen. So that... huh? I'll have to either mute the Discord on my stream or just do something so that whatever music it is doesn't get heard and then I'll get copyright struck. Yeah, like I said, I'm sharing my screen instead of vice versa. Okay. 
to make it easier. Yeah. I am not giving you any context to this whatsoever. I want you to see if you can figure it out based on the song alone. Let me know when you're ready. Let me... There you are. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Let me mute Discord stuff. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I'm on PC, so I don't know why I can't see it. Huh. Such dark lyrics, even when the song is written in major. I love it. I'm like, damn. I, now, granted, I haven't seen the show myself. Right. But I found this one, and I was like, okay. It, it, I want to see what your thoughts are on it. I mean, it's super cool, honestly. That definitely has me curious. Hmm? I'm definitely curious of it. Like, wanting to watch the series. I want to watch the series, too, actually. I've seen a lot of funny shit and some weird shit. It obviously has its moments. It's not a kid's show by any means. Um, But to give context, from what I do know, the, the creature in question that she touched her scepter to... Yeah. That creature is known as the Nightmare King. And it is the main villain of the series. I know that much. Huh. Mm -hmm. Also, I think I figured out why you guys weren't able to see uh, my VC. For whatever reason, the access for your guys' role as collaborators was broken. So I had to reestablish that. There you go. See? So we're not... So it wasn't us then. Nah. Goddamn. Cat I am Kitty, Jingle and I Kitty. smash. But yes, yeah, so that, that's, the, that's the Nightmare King. And I guess, from the context of it, I suppose that that's the person or creature that he originally was before becoming the Nightmare King. Huh. Now, the thing is, I don't know who that character is, but I'm assuming she was either a lover or is a lover or someone because the line, the poison you fed me. Right. And the fact that she was getting emotional. And the fact she, that he also emotional. said, my love, she's you're finally angry. free. Yeah, but you can tell, like, she's she's very bitter and angry, but also there's a sadness to her when she sees him. Oh, yeah. 
She kept looking away. She really, as much as she felt like she wanted to do this, there was still a part of her that was conflicted. Yeah, because even the first one, when she does it, she comes down to him and she gently caresses his face and tells him, I would have loved you. So something happened. Me. <laughs> Clark. But, uh, yeah, I, I saw that and I was like, oh, I kind of want to watch this, though. Yeah. Oh, ah. wait, not the Nightmare King. I'm sorry, he's called the Nowhere King. Oh, the Nowhere King. Yes, Nowhere King. Let's see. Nightmare King made me think of fucking um, Fantasy High. No, yeah, no, 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 no. But he's the, he's the Nowhere King. Gotcha. All right, time to do some more voices again. Hey, be quiet over there. Honestly, those dogs think they own the street. So there you are. What took you so long? Did you forget to flap your wings? I don't have wings. Actually, you know what? Since you're in VC... How about I share my screen? And let you be able to see. There we go. What?! Oh what? yeah, that's right. I forgot to... There's also a parallel. That song is a parallel. Oh, like a reprise? Yes, yeah, so... That's that because I heard it before. Okay, here I'll show it to you real quick. So keeping in oh mind, oh my word, I gotta meet you again on stream. It's okay. Oh, so that's a motif. Ooh, okay. Oh, I thought. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I already have you muted, muted on stream. Okay, I'm good. Yeah. Oh, I fucking love that. No, it's all cute. It's a lullaby, but it's a song basically about madness. Oh, now we're getting in the freaky. That's not even sung. That's just chanted. Oh, in the hissing. Oh. Ooh. 
Yeah. No, I love when motifs like that in the in music are basically kind of thrown on their head. Like the representation is still there, but the context on why it, on why it's used overpowers it. Oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah. All right, now I can unmute. That I can unmute you. <laughs> People can hear the full conversation. But yeah, notice how it went through progressive changes. Oh as, yeah. As like, from the beginning, one it's like, ah, yes, come, it's inviting, it's slow, it's a good world, da da da. da. But it's like if you're not listening to the lyrics, you can easily be taken by like. The child like Hun, I try to make my own musical in high school. You don't think I know the, this kind of shit? <laughs> I'm explaining for the people who don't feed her kid. <laughs> also, no one heard it. So how the fuck are they going to know what we're talking about? Fair. Also, look. I see. That's you. In a box. But, um, are we in Japan? I think this is Japan. I just saw, like, the housing and then the open stall markets like this. I was like, this looks like Japan Japanese market streets. Yeah. You want to voice this other cat? Uh, sure. Excuse me. Hi. I was wondering if you could help me. The mirror. If the mirror can't help you, no one can. Thank goodness I found you. You see, your worship, I need to get home and I need shinies and there are all these trash cans and... One thing at a time, friend. This all sounds like work. Cats are not built for work. Cats are built for mischief and snoring. We are soft, sleepy. Sometimes there is we are my niece wants Sometimes to make there some is pushing stuff out things onto the me. floor. Yeah, but your enthusiasm is tiring. The mayor cannot help anyone when sleepy. I didn't mean to. So you must help the mayor achieve nap time. It's only right and proper. I. Your first responsibility as deputy mayor will be to will be the hated jars of jam. Mm -hmm. These eyesores from the mayor's vision. But it's just jam. It is a symbol, a symbol. Human no longer fears the cat. They leave their jars, their glass jars on shelves, and expect them to stay there. It cannot continue. I guess that makes sense. But when you say remove them... Swipe! Push! Crash! The breaking of the jars will be a lullaby for your poor mayor. And then you'll help me? The mayor cannot hear you over the noise of symbolic jam. <laughs> oh yeah, we're in Japan. They really said, let's put this shit up high so that we can't smash them. Oh, hello? Oh. Are you just pissed <laughs> off? Yes, the lady is pissed off. I'm gonna stay up here. Oh yeah, you smashed her jam jars for no fucking reason. I'm a cat! Yes. <laughs> well, she put them up high so that you wouldn't smash them, and here you are smashing them for a random ass cat. 
Namely, Whoa. she wants to make some clay gnomes with me. I can't fucking Aww. sleep. Aww. That's adorable, though, Florg. I hope everything goes well. Alright, number two? <laughs> um, she gonna smack you with that fucking brute? Not if I stay up here. She's too stupid to look up. After the third jar. She's too stupid to look up. No, she. I think she knows where the jars fell from. Especially because that one's directly in her path. Look at her. She doesn't even know that I did anything wrong. She just looked at you. Because she doesn't know what cat did it. She thinks it's hers. I've never heard of a cat hating jars so goddamn much. What is she doing? <laughs> what? <laughs> Come get me, bitch! Come get me! You really put jam uh, prints all over the ground? Yep. See? You deserve that. You deserve that. <laughs> Those are so cute fucking meows, though. You forgot to talk to the mayor. Perfect. The mayor can now slumber. Um, before you do, your grace, you said you could help. Yes, the mayor will now dispense valuable assistance. Thank you. For helping me, I will teach you the official way to respond to jam jars. Wait, what? Or anything else that is terrible. The voila! <laughs> we get emotes! I don't know if that's the game talking or... Oh. I, I, no, it is, um... It is, uh, the cat, because look at where the, like, tail is pointing from. Oh, okay, um... You may now express disgust at any moment by holding the X button. That wasn't quite what... The mayor has no need of your gratitude, little deputy. Oh, sorry, yes. Thank you, or not thank you. And now the mayor must rest. So sleepy, so anyone to hear the requests for help. But... <laughs> what a lazy-ass shit! He's got a little old lady for a cat. What do you use it? What do you expect? Let me bap. 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 He's very fluffy. He is fluffy. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Fucking menace. I'm a cat, of course! Watch this man go no, after me. Cats are menaces. Get that man back his shit. Nope! <laughs> I'm gonna I... recycle it and I'm gonna be rich. Recycle it where? You're a cat. What do you have any need for money? Look, we're trying to get shinies for the crow. This is arguably a shiny, right? The crow wants a coin or some shit. I don't think they mean this. But go ahead, give it to the crow. Watch it reject you. <laughs> Just need to remember where the hell the crow is. Just went in a whole Congratulations, circle. Congratulations, you backtracked in a circle. That's what I literally just said. I was gonna say, what the fuck was that? Oh, shiny. That, that is what the, see? That's what he wants, not the cell phone. Well, then fine. <laughs> oh, you want to see something terrible? Why would you do that? Because I love the animations. It's so cartoony. Do I need to jingle your keys? 
when I have such an adorable game like this, are you really expecting <laughs> that something like something like some key jingling is going to entice me? There we go. Really, Mishka? Really? Uh-oh, what'd she do? No. What did she do? Road, you can hear me, right? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yes, I don't think you heard that, though. I, I mean, I heard you bad-mouthing Mishka. No, 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 you're not hearing, okay. The reason, I'm not bad-mouthing her. It's that, unlike you, and you can't say it's a cat thing, because I literally pulled my keys out of my, out of my purse, and she immediately rushed over. <laughs> and I'm jingling them right now, but I don't think Discord is picking it up. And now, she, she's like staring at him, she's like, keys, keys, where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going, Mom? I'm, but I'm literally jingling my keys. That's why I asked, can you hear me? Because I don't think my Discord... No, I me. I did not hear the keys. Fuck you. Fuck you, Discord, and your goddamn microphone, and your fucking grain and shit. Where the fuck are you, Discord? It's fuck you. It's probably the noise suppression. That's Do what not... I'm saying. Fuck you. It's the one time I don't want it. Where is it? Uh, oh, God. No! I... Why are the keys working on you? Hmm? Actually... Road. Yeah? Look, look at this. I turn on my camera for a moment so you can see this. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah! She is so intrigued. What does this mean, Kimishka? What the keys mean? What the keys mean, Mishka? What does this little jingle mean, huh? What does this mean? Look at her tail. Look at her friggin' tail. Yeah. Come here. No, 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 that's going up. Okay, it is, that is where we do go, but that's not. No! <laughs> she walked around to the other side and jumped on me. <laughs> Mischievous dog. Yes. But I was like, if it works on Mishka, it works on you, so fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have another friendo. Hmm. Here's a fresh face. Have you come to see the birds? I've never seen them so close before. Not without glass in the way. Ah, uh, an indoor cat. That explains it. Can I get even closer to them? You can, yes. In fact, you can even um, hold Rhoda, them. I'll be right back. I'm gonna run out for a moment. I'm gonna be in VC, but I'm just gonna mute myself, but I'm gonna run out for like a quick moment. E. The trick is to sneak up near to them without without scaring them. Then, you pounce. That took me by surprise. All the best pouncing does, little one. But they are quite cautious. Certainly cautious enough to avoid a little cat. That said, I suppose there's always the bread proposition. The bread proposition? The bread proposition. It works as follows. 1. Obtain bread. 2. Use bread as bait for birds. 3. Pounce! Ah! Okay, okay. Got it. Bread equal plus birds equals catching. But, um, do you have any bread I could borrow? 
Alas, no. Bread comes from humans, not cats. It's in their pockets, in their briefcases, even clutched in their hands. Does that make it theirs? Temporarily. But it can be yours if you master the art of getting underfoot. The art of what? Just swipe at their feet when they walk. When they trip, the bread will fall. Thank you for the advice. Now to steal people's lunch. Oh, hi! Oh. <laughs> Didn't think that I would have uh, a human like come up to me and be like, "Oh, I want to pet you." Target acquired. Ah! Hey, human, come here. Trip, motherfucker. Trip. Oh, where's your sandwich? I thought you had a sandwich. There it is. Target acquired. <laughs> I shall plop it here. Come on, get the bread. Who wants the bread? Birdie want bread? Damn. Welp, my sister said no to that since my niece needs to clean up her mess. Ah. Ah, too far. Ah, I was able to get this one without the bread. Give. <laughs> nice. Come here, buddy. Come to Papa! Let's go. And Yib. Yib feather. Well, hello. Cut. <laughs> Thank you. I'll be taking that. Anyone else? Ooh, 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 ooh. LOL, the bird was watching you. Basically. <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel with the random bird shit coming on the ground. <laughs> like, I know it's realistic and it's immersive, but like, now I'm worried that I'm going to get hit with bird shit. Oh, I forgot to turn that off, actually. So I was contemplating if I wanted to get zooting on stream or not. I mean, I do have the 420 um, point redeem on in case that does end up being a thing tonight. But I should probably turn that off for now. Oh, 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 oh. Hello! Come here, come here, come here, come here, come 
Okay, that's six. How many am I going to get? Also, I love how the slow-mo of these birds' uh, wings flapping almost sounds like like a plane propeller. Also, random fact, bread, if I remember right, is not all that great for birds, especially geese. Don't feed your... Uh, don't feed any of the bird life around you bread. It will actually congest their system and make it basically difficult for them to digest because bread is something that birds cannot digest. What the? Are you just a big boy? Yeah. Oh yeah, oh, I wait, forgot no, maybe, to tell Yab at not. the place I volunteer at. I was challenged to make a crab with gun. Wait. <laughs> How did that go? I did it. You're faster than you look. Thanks. Thank. I appreciate that you let go of it. This is strictly a catch and release neighborhood. Well, what else would I do with it? Ah. Ah. Quite. By the way, hang on to those feathers. I hear some animals like to collect them. Are you sure the birds are okay with this? You know what? It's never come up. But you're probably a bit tense after all that leaping about. Try this relaxation technique. You can use it by holding down X. Oh! See you around, little one. Alright, hold X. And we get all of our... Well, I made a crab with a gun with smaller crab gunners. Nice. A little lie down. <laughs> When can I become loaf? I want to be loaf. But we shall stretch. I think it's super neat how they decided to go for like this pink uh, kind of outline for all the characters and everything. It really makes everything pop in a way that's not like obtrusive. Like, everything is outlined in this pinkish color. And it's a really nice pink. Nearly! <laughs> Just a little! Oh, yes! Now get out of here! Uh-oh. Everything okay in there? Until a moment ago, it's yes! It's displayed in their city diorama that they have. Hey! Nice, Flark! That's awesome! It was easy to get in, so I assumed it would be exactly as easy to get out. Would you like some help? Let me try one more thing! Awesome I'm ready to be helped now. Of a cat. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm ready to be helped now, please. If I push from here, can you pull me? Is this even a cat? No! That is not a cat! Thank you! You're welcome. What were you doing in there? I was looking for some feathers for my new invention and I saw something glinting in the pipe. I assumed it must be the famous inverted collector's edition Deku commemorative medallion, and well, here I went. Why would you assume that? I was manifesting success with my thoughts. Did it work? 
Well, no. But imagine if it had. Why do you want the, uh, the imported collecting gecko thingy? These medallions are the ones with the weird error that makes Gekko look like a weird sea monster exposed to nuclear radiation instead of a big gecko a nuke, exposed to nuclear radiation. They're worth a fortune, but it turned out to be a normal shiny, and then I got stuck. You want it? Please. Here. Thank you. Did you say you were an inventor? I did! I love to solve problems. Some animals even say I make new problems just so I can solve them. How rude. Rude? No, it's like a compliment. Like when they say, oh dear, this will take some getting used to, or Tanuki, you really shouldn't have, or I didn't know a raccoon could disrupt this much space time. Actually, that last one was pretty rude. I very clearly a Tanuki, not a raccoon. What's a raccoon? It's like a bear fox with a long stripy tail. Apparently some people think they look like Tanuki, but I can't see it myself. What are you working on now? Ah, it's all very exciting. In fact, that's why I needed the- Wait, do you smell feathers? What does a feather even smell like? You have feathers somewhere about your person, I know it. Although goodness knows where you're keeping them. These? Yes, I knew it. Oh, 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 how exciting! Gimme, gimme, gimme! Wh whoops, I forgot my manners. Please, gimme! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Now, do you want to see a cool invention at the store space time? Behold the magic of engineering! Knee portal, huh? Guess where it goes! The sewers? Not anymore! That flashy, swirly glow isn't just the sewer vapors, it's magic! And that means it's now part of the pet work! Do you mean network? I do not! It is a network, but it's for you! A pet! Where does it go? Well, this is a proof of concept, so it actually only goes over there. But! That still bypasses the fence, so you should so you shouldn't hold back on your admiration. Hop in, and let me know if it works. Wait, what? Ta da! I said, ta da! Is that my cue? Wait, where are you? Uh, well, it's completely dark and smells exciting. Does that sound like a place? Completely dark? Uh oh, let me consult my feedback questionnaire. Okay, here we go. Question one Is test subject in possession of own eyeball? Why would I not have my own eyeballs? I'll take that as a yes. Question two. Is test subject in possession of all necessary limbs? There are unnecessary limbs? Uh, seems like the test subject is becoming uncooperative. Why don't you try moving around and see, and, and, and we can see if that answers the limb question. Oh, we're in the trash can again! Oh, uh, where am I? Oh, you landed in the trash? Why didn't you say so in the first place? The trash? That's why the smell was familiar. This is very exciting. It means the pet work works! I just need to fine tune the arrival system a little. Let me know when you've done that and I'll hop in and come back. Come back? Come back. You know, the return journey. The return what? The bit where I come back to that first portal, Tanaki. Fascinating. Yes, I can use how the, I, I can see how that would be useful. Especially with how you're now on the other side of an unclimbable fence and everything. Tell you what, I'll get to work on that return journey and you can go explore. How long do you think it will take? I find that there are fewer recriminations when I do not 
that when I do not to commit to when I do not commit to deadlines, um, error on dialogue. <laughs> I'll be in touch when the improvements are ready for a test of lab assistant. Bye. All right. <sighs> Wait, I can't... Mm, actually, oh, stairs. Keeps it aside. Fuck off, dog. <gasps> I see nest. I <laughs> Really? There was just one lousy little shiny in there. Damn, okay. Ooh, this will be exciting. Ooh, 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 ooh. A bone? <gasps> I can befriend the dog! I can befriend the dog! Shiva, you shall be my companion. <laughs> hey, I was trying to be nice to you, you shit. See, so putting it in your bowl. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is going harder on that bone. Land someone on my system going hard on a dick. <laughs> Speedy dog. <laughs> a corn hat? I gotta see this. <laughs> it looks so stupid. <laughs> the the apple's cuter. Okay. Oh, oh, trash, trash, trash. Time for some corny jokes if you put that hat on. Oh, uh, <laughs> I just might. Oh, more recycling. <laughs> All right, now to find a recycling spot. Make sure that I don't encounter the human. Really? As soon as I am out of the construction area? You dumbass man! Ooh, what do you got to say? Oh no, oh no, oh no! Are you okay? Do I look okay? Sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to snap. That's okay. Has something happened? I made a big mistake! Big! Huge! <laughs> Would it help to talk it out? Maybe? 
But it feels too huge for such a small kitty to help with, though. I mean, as mistakes go, this is even bigger than the great hashtag shadow ban of catastrophe of 2021. The what, what, what a what? Because how can I be expected to run a hashtag effective hashtag taffy takeover on social media without a working phone? What's a phone? Is this, is this thing next to me? Oh, my human has one of those, but it's less gloopy. So is mine, usually. I dropped it in the wet concrete. <laughs> what does lol mean? Oh, it just means laughing out loud. But you weren't laughing at all. Oh, I wasn't actually supposed to laugh for that, but you weren't laughing at all. You were sad. Ah, but if I say lol when I am sad, you can't tell I'm sad, or at least that was the idea. Lol. I see. Right? In dropping the phone thingy is why you're upset. Yes! I need it for work! Taffy is going to fire me for sure if I don't fix it! Oh. Who's Taffy? She's... She's kind of my boss? Or she would be if I was getting paid. She's an icon! A phenomenon! I think for... I think Firm's magazine called her the fluffiest billionaire on the internet. A fluffy nightmare. Wait, is Taffy a cat? No, Taffy is the cat. Lol, that's her up there. Prissy ass bitch. Oh, I know her. I see her in my human's phone. She has the coolest house and the best outfits and the fluffiest fur. I picked those outfits, and I styled that fur. In fact, I was here looking for inspiration when I dropped the phone. No phone means no internet. No internet means no new Taffy content for her fans. Lol. But that's dreadful news. We have to fix it. Let me think. I know. I'll get you a new phone. You can do that? I think so. Humans have at least one phone thingy each, so let's just borrow one. They love Taffy, so they'll be delighted to help. Wait right here, Beetle. I'll be back with the phone in no time. LOL! LMAO! Thanks! What hat is this? Oh, it's a hard hat! Can I inspect your snacks? Down I go. Wrong button. Neither of them have phones. Uh -huh. What? Also, it is so creepy with some of these having like absolutely no face. Oh, there's one. So you're gonna go all the way around. There we go. All right, where are the people going? Where do the people go? I wanna be where the people are. I want to see, want to see them suffer. <laughs> oh. Walking without their phones. 
as I take them myself. <laughs> oh my word! Next victim. Where is my next victim? Here we go. Hehehehe. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, I gotta be sure that the construction worker... Okay, I'm gonna wait until he's fully around for me to go back in. I almost got hit with shit. Ah, oh, fuck. <gasps> I have brought you a phone. You did it? Thank you so, so much! Do you want the old one? It still takes pictures. You just can't do emailing or anything. What's emailing? You don't know emailing? I don't think so. So, you've never been CC'd. Or heard the praise, per my last message? Nope. Although I do per all my messages. Now that I come to think about it. What an absolutely blissful life you must lead, kitty. Anyway, here's your phone. The concrete dipped phone. <laughs> it might not be smart anymore, but the camera still works. Press the Taking photos is really simple. Just bring up the camera, pose, and click. In fact, you should take a celebratory selfie right now. Bring up the camera and get snapping. You know what? There we go. Nice little commemorative picture. Now to take this to the nearest recycling spot. After we demolish the concrete. <laughs> ah. Hi. What? So many people are wanting to come up to me when I'm just trying to deposit. Oh, can I not deposit this? Oh, it's a ramen can. That's a that's a styrofoam ramen can, not a fucking like soda can. What the? Angry birds. Angry birds, clearly. Come here. Let me... There we go. 
All right. There's a can. Yay! I just need two more. Ah, oh, I need a bone. I need another bone. Wait. Hmm. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. I cannot believe that worked. Look at all those cans. Look at all those chickens. Oh, what I wouldn't give for like one of those daggum, uh, Two people were wanting to obsess over me and I made them bonk into each other. Oh, that's rich. Oh, that's fucking rich. But, um, Larg, you remember those, um, like those, like, juice, uh, tea mix things that had, like, the flavored boba style kind of stuff in them, right? I am craving one of those so hard. Cause that sounds so fucking good. Also, if I am being too loud, let me know. Hey, yo. Hello. <gasps> and what is this place? We can nap in a little sun garden! Oh! Look at this! <laughs> oh, this is perfect! I'm, t I'm taking a picture. Th this is like the perfect picture game. Holy shit. This is adorable. Here we go. All right. Time to wake up. There we go. Now for the better question. Are there bones? Because I need a bone to subdue the Shiva. <gasps> Iguana? Or chameleon? Oh my god! Oh 
Look at him! Look at him! Hello? Are you talking to me? Of course! You can see me? Uh, yes? Astonishing. I've never been anyone who could see through my superior camouflage. Does this mean my power is fading? Who are you? I've known my many names. The Shrouded Sensation. The Invisible wi Lizard. The- Wait! Where did you go? Wonder! I have honed my camouflage craft to the point where I can blend in perfectly with my surroundings! Or so I thought. For example, I am so good at disguising myself that I can't even make my words disappear! Watch this. See that? No, you didn't, because my words are totally camouflaged! Huh. That's pretty cool. Thank you. It took years to perfect. But if you're a master of camouflage, how come I can see you? Quite. Perhaps it's to do with your eyes being so weird. Oh no, has something happened to my eyes? Have you seen them? I don't think I can. You'll have to tell me. They're beady and green. Well, for a start, they're on the front of your face. That's weird. It is? And they don't seem to stick out at all. They're right inside your head, taking a valuable brain room. Maybe I use my eyes for thinking? Can you at least move them in different directions at the same time? I don't think so. Should I be worried, do you think? Uh -huh. Hey, Dogman, hope you're doing well. <laughs> I see you're in VC. Give me a hot sec. How's it well, going? Well, hello there. How's it going? It's going decently. Today was very boring, apart from my sister's birthday. That was at the very least interesting. Well, hey, hopeful, hope that uh, the birthday went well. It did, it did. Hmm, you've got it a browser source. Oh, is it? Yeah, well... Like, like I said a few times now, like, because of the, uh, because of having to reset my computer's OS, like, I lost everything when it came to my OBS, so I have to add everyone's mm. P, I have to add everyone's PNGs from scratch. Ah, alright. You know what, since you're here, do you want to voice a chameleon? Chameleon? Uh, what, did you see the chameleon and thought, Dogman would be perfect for this? Basically. <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> what kind of voice are you thinking? I don't know. What, what do you? They, what kind of character do you, they seem to have? Um. Wanna be magician? I couldn't say. I'm a magician, not a vet. However, if your weird inferior eyes are truly immune to my vanishing act. Oh wait, I would need to. Uh... Yeah, you might. Then I have a <laughs> financial. Then I have finally met a worthy opponent. Wait, what? I must learn to outsmart your weird eyes. I will don you disguises, practice you tricks, engage in the noble art of self improvement. I don't want you to change on my account. A sweet kitty, so weird, so small, so wrong. No, to restore my reputation as the world's most concealed creature, I must change. It's my whole shtick. <laughs> it is the only way to defeat your weird eyes. When you say you want to defeat my eyes... I challenge you to find me again, cat! Here? No, I shall leave this place while I adjust my technique. Then I shall reappear. Somewhere else. Obviously, I will do. I will be almost impossible to detect, so I will leave you with a clue to my general direction. Uh, so location. Ahem. 
There's a place where hard hats shine, where concrete pours and diggers whine. I'll be camouflaged nearby, invisible to your weird eye. Do you mean eyes? Have you heard of poetic license? <laughs> this cat is so innocent. Also, why do you have a scar on your ass cheek? No idea. Well, I have one and I'm not afraid to use it. Anyway, good luck finding me. I think probably the zing. I think probably the kitty got the scar when falling down from the apartment building. Oh shit. Anyways, that's definitely a construction site. Oh, d definitely. Ah, let me up. There we go. Hey, yo. Mmm, <laughs> bird. So, who y who are you buying stuff with with that? Um, I have to give some shinies to various crows. Okay, I was wondering what matter of animals uh, you had to entice. Yeah, just a normal corvid. All right. If it was if it was a a uh, raven or a, a, a sparrow, sorry, a sparrow, then I'd be like, Oop. watch your back. Crafty little shits. <laughs> what, had some not so great experiences with some sparrows? You could say that. In any case, though, all animals warrant to be uh, cautious around. Yeah. To some degree. <gasps> oh, it's a plushie! <laughs> Look at it! I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm sorry, this game is too adorable. Oh no, I gotta get it! What is the game? Little Kitty Big City. It just came out on the 9th. Little Kitty Big City. Oh, I don't see a gimmick with this at all. I wonder, so, I'm, guess I... I'm guessing you love the game so far? Absolutely. This is adorable. Okay, so the plushie will not entice you. I have to get behind you and get you a bone for your dog bowl. Got it. If you find one, that is. I mean, I found one for a dog earlier. I just need to find one for this dog. And I also want to get behind there to get that hat. Uh... Alright, I think now's probably the best time to go to the crow. Which, where is the crow? Take a look in here. Where is the entrance in here again? There we go. Hey, you want to take a guess on what I'm playing? What are you playing? I said guess. Uh, hell divers. What? I don't, do I look like the, the type of person that would play that? I, I I have no idea. I just know that people like it right now. Mm. Okay, I will give you a hint. All right. It's a controversial game for some... for old people to play because it's so associated with younger audiences. And 
that it is very versatile for something so simple. Hmm. And could be considered an internet classic. Where a bunch of memes also popped up from. Oh, shoot. That doesn't help me because there are so many games that are yeah. basically meme-worthy. Oh, by the way, do you mind going back where you were? I thought uh, I spotted something. And I, I was trying to find... The chameleon? The little, yep. Yeah. See, that's the mm. beetle. Okay, just a moment. Eyes more upwards. Turn. Slowly. I think I see a spot somewhere in the blue. In the blue? Out in the blue. Ah! We a weird blue spot. Yep. That lighter Seemingly blue. The... Yep. Well, if you can well. try. It looks like a, just a regular spot. Yeah. Ah. Huh. Well. Any vantage point is good. Definitely. You. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. From that angle, do you think you could have spotted behind the curtain? Let's see. Honestly, you could you could check every wall to an at an angle to make sure that they are flat. Yeah. So, what did he look like when he was camouflaged? Um, before he wasn't even camouflaged at all. He was just out in the open. Green on green, or just... Like, he was green through and through. Uh, on a... On a background that was just gray. And, so, he really wasn't, uh... Camouflaged all that well. You might try your luck with some green foliage. Depends how lazy the uh, people who made the game are. Or it could be that the whole point is that the chameleon is lazy in and of itself. I mean, there's there's verdure, um, there's verdant stuff hmm. over behind, kind of. Not towards the street, but uh, in that like little alleyway where see where there's a wall blocking, I guess. There's shiny, of course. Over there. Yeah. I have plenty of shinies right now, though. So let's try. Construction cones over there. Somewhere near. Okay, the Tanuki's gone. the heck is that thing? Oh, that's a dog. Excuse me. And yes, that is a dog who I gave a bone. Oh, right. look how happy they are. Oh, you can go on top of the van and go back towards the construction site from there. Or is, is that a toilet? Yes, that is. <laughs> that is an look. outhouse. Look in it. Oh, there he is! Uh, I'm good. I am good. Thank you. And he can change color. He just is not good at seeing where it is. Right. You found me again! But how? Should, should we be honest, but... Be honest, we're trying to help this guy in his craft. Yeah. 
Hmm, it seems that my search for the perfect camouflage continues. I shall continue to make adjustments while I wait. You in a new location. They say the third time's the charm, after all. There's a clue for when you're ready to try and track me down. A metal friend with arms spread wide provides a place to climb and slide. But you won't know I'm there at all because I'll be invisible. Are you sure invisible rhymes with at all? Honestly, I'm not the best at work, but I could have spent more time on the clue if you'd taken longer to find me. I'm confident about my next adjustment, though, so further rhymes should be unnecessary. Good luck. How do you like my impressions? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> <laughs> ah! I almost could have gotten the bird. So, do you eat and kill birds, or? Nope, it's catch and release. You just get uh, feathers that fall off of them. I'm guessing the birds are very happy to be part of that. It's never been established. What the cat doing? The, the the human wanted to try and give me pads, but I was on the other side of the wall. Ha ha! Stupid human. Ha ha! Stupid human. <laughs> <laughs> I am Lord Freezer. Hey, you monkeys! Quit gawking over there. Ugh, man. Freezer was nasty. Uh, well, from what I could tell. Yeah. Here's the crow I'm looking for. Are all of these shinies? You know what, since you're here... Yeah, getting... that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm going to make him sound grubby. So shiny, so pretty, so reflective. Who's a pretty crow? Are you disposing of them responsibly? Yes. And with that, we have completed our first heroic act together. Can I try disposing of them? And why do you sound like a mafioso? Definitely not. These are ancient crow rituals. Also, I don't sound like a mafioso. I've just eaten too many cigarette butts. <laughs> well, do I get a, do I get my reward? Your what? Oh yeah, your reward. Now, where on earth did I see that fish? Just a minute. Wait, Crow? Was this a scam? Where did he go? Here. Whoa, a fish. This should give you some climbing energy. Not enough to get all the way home, but it's a start. Where would I start climbing? There, you see the IVs? You're going to need to you're going to need more fish to make it all the way to the top. But Ivy's will help you. Do you I mean, video have video game logic? Do you have any more? Not right now, but I've seen them elsewhere in the city. Just keep your eyes open and you'll find them. Thank you. No worries. Enjoy the fish. Oh, and keep a hold of any shinies you find out there. I've just had an idea. Also, I love how the the scent of the fish is like permeating oh actually that's good that means it's a sign that you can actually use to track fish down so keep an eye out for smelly smells oh yeah and i would suggest eating the fish right there and there yeah ready set nom basically <laughs> This delicious fish has given you the energy to climb ivy! Give it a try. Nice. Feels so much better. Let's go climb some ivy.
<laughs> Mark, hello there. I wonder if you could provide some uh, urgent assistance. I think it depends on the problem. Eh? Oh, I see. Quite right, quite right. I don't want to alarm anyone, yeah, that's rather a present concern, although perhaps I'm just panicking. <laughs> but there's no two ways about it. Um, about what? Oh, didn't I say? I seem to have mislaid my ducklings. Mislaid? Is this a bird joke? I don't follow. Never mind. Missing duckling sounds pretty serious. It does, doesn't it? What happened? Well, we were all enjoying an educational tour of the neighborhood, me teaching the youngsters some local history, etc. For example, you know the robot statue in the park behind us? Robot I statue. Didn't Alien. even know that there was a robot statue. Oh, you should absolutely visit it. You see, the robot is quite fascinating. Not a statue in the traditional sense, either. Legend has it that a wise duck, not too dissimilar from myself, in fact, might visit this park every day with his robot friend. Very loyal robots. Delightful. Back then, this was a lake. Hulking, great, wet thing where the pair would swim. Splashing and frolicking. You know the sort of thing, but... Robots in water, eh? Eh? All that fizzing and sputtering? Not simpatico at all. Rust patches, wet, wet circuitry, exploding knees. The robot, not the duck, I mean. Also, that, <laughs> that man sneezed because he's allergic. The robots, swimming, the swimming days were over. Terribly sad stuff. So we asked the duck to change his programming. Quite the feat, if you ask me. Could never get my head around computer stuff. The duck helped program the robot to wait in the playground while the duck swam. Grand idea, that. And it went beautifully. But! One fine day, probably much like this one, truth be told, the duck was attacked by a radioactive monster! Wait, a monster? Gecko! Usually, Gecko is our protector! You know, breathing fire, saving orphans, charity galas. Lovely chap apart from the rampages, really. Rampages? Oh, yes! Humans write those up in the little paper documentaries. Very engaging, really. Paper documentary? Do you mean comics? So, Gekko kidnaps the duck and whoopsie daisy throws him through the star portal. Whoosh! Wah! Never to be seen again. And the thing we mistake for a statue in the playground is actually the loyal robot waiting patiently for his friend to return from his swim. Are you saying that Gekko kidnapped your children? Oh no, it's just a great story. I shared it with the ducklings before we split up to find more neighborhood stories for our little show and tell session. Show and tell? That sounds fun. Eh? Oh yes, I thought so. Anyway, we scampered off in different directions, all very exciting at the moment. But, uh, and I suppose this is the crux of the matter, really. I didn't set a time or place for us to reconvene. Aha! Uh -huh. Wasn't sure what to do for the best. Not really a practical duck, you see. But I didn't want to use the... But I didn't want us to be rushing around missing one another. Dreadful when that happens. So I retracted... I retraced my steps back here and waited. No luck? Alas, no. But you seem like a practical sort of cat. Very resourceful. So, could we team up? I'll keep watch here. Been kind of enjoying it, really. And you scout the city? The whole city? Seems pretty big. Ah, you're right. There must be a way for us to narrow down our search. Eureka! Also, Zelda, hope you're doing well. We made a city map just last week. Marvelous thing. Part of our project is to catalog all the different fish hotspots in the city. The Zucklids marked each of their favorite places on it, too. Such enthusiasm for maps, and I bet that's where they all have gone. Here, you take it. My orienting skills are dreadful, but you'll be able to track them down in no time. Nice. Just ignore the fish markers. Can't see what interest that would be for a kitty, unless you're a budding but ichthyologist, of course. All right, let me just go past you. Oh, Tanuki! I am here to remind Road that he's amazing, <laughs> wonderful, talented, handsome, cute, loved, oh. and appreciated. 
I don't trust that Tanuki. He look a little shifty. <laughs> Thank you, Zelda. I really hope you're doing chief. well. I mean, do you want to voice the Tanuki? Okay. <clears throat> Hey, hello, yes, uh, I, your Steam Lab assistant. I managed to get the pet work team portals connected up properly. That was quick. It would have been even quicker, but there was a minor space time incident. Nothing to worry about, though. You almost sound like when uh, Markiplier does Will for Warps. <laughs> God dang it. How minor? In the grand scheme of the multiverse, it was just absolutely trivial. Just a teeny tiny set of water pipe explosion that fell out of the future and the other universe and into the recent past of this universe. Hey, now on a moment. Is that where all this water comes from? It turns out I've been using linear space time when I should have used quadratic space time. Laughable, really. Also, I think you just got shitted on. Oh, never mind. Near miss. You want to try it out? It's really cool, and I need a test uh, friend to help me out. This drastic space time is safe now, isn't it? Quadratic space time. Now you mention it, it's drastic space time could be very intriguing too. Are uh, either of them safe? I assume so. You're just going to have to figure that out, aren't you, buddy? <laughs> anyway, if we get this work, you can use it to fast travel around the city. Wouldn't that be useful, little kitty? I mean, considering how big this map will be. Don't say no just yet. Hear me out. But I said yes. Firstly, there are... Wait, what? I said yes. Oh, for real? Call me curious. Yeah, this is so exciting. You won't regret it. <laughs> Do you need feathers again? Not this time. Your first journey was so short that I had leftovers. Hop in. It's going to work this time. I'm 100% sure. Give or take. Don't remember if I ever told you or not yet, but I won an art raffle the other day. Hey yo, nice Zelda, let's go! Oh, oh, oh! It's you! You came back! I thought I scared you off when I jumped off at the window! That was you? Goodness me, you did give me a bit of a fright. Sorry, sorry, I just got so excited when people come to visit. You're a dog, right? Only the best is best goodest dog! My human says so! It's nice to meet you properly. I didn't know there was an official bestest best dog title. Ah, you may know me by my other accolades. Perhaps the squishiest, smushiest potato. Or the fuzziest, happiest little pooper. Wait, my owner told me that I was the squishiest, smushiest potato. Are you sure? Certain. I remember she said it several times while smushing my tummy with her nose. Gosh, that award must have multiple animal categories then. It's a pleasure to meet a fellow potato. Likewise. Anyway, it was lovely to chat. I hope you have a good day. Um, don't go. There's a scene that happened. Can you help me, little potato? What do you need help with? I've lost my balls. Uh... <laughs> oh, my tennis balls are gone! Come through oh, and I'll show I... you. I swear, was this going to be like a Rick and Morty moment of like, where are my balls, Summer? Which okay, ones? I'll have to say this right now. <laughs> my dog's about to lose his balls on uh, this. A uh, this, not not Monday. What's the day after Monday? Tuesday. Yeah. Poor boy. Okay. Hi, Flargs. <laughs> Look! No balls! Um, I appreciate that I 
Well, I appreciate this might be a silly question. Don't think that's quite the right Sub word. Zelda. I, I think this might be a silly question, but aren't they behind you? What? Oh, those? No, those are just my regular favorite tennis balls. I'm talking about my extra special favorite favorite tennis balls. They're very different. What happened to them? Oh, well, you see, uh, Tanuki built me a present. Ah, let me guess. There was an incident of some sort? Not to start with. It was so cool. You could put tennis balls in and it would throw them for me while my owner was at work. That sounds really nice. It was perfect for a while. But, um, uh, <laughs> it also did go rogue one day. Balls everywhere. And then it caught on fire a tiny bit. I've got most of them back, but my three favorite favorites are still missing. And the machine? I buried it. But please don't tell Tanaki. She would be so sad. Um, and also, please, 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 can you help me find my favorite balls? I'd be grateful. Sure. But how will I know if they're your favorites? Don't all tennis balls look the same? Absolutely not. Each one is subtly different from the others. The scent, the taste, the texture, the personality. I'm not sure I'd be able to tell the favorites from the non-favorites if that's the case. Well, my favorite balls also have bright rainbow-colored stripes. Now that's a description I can work with. Shall I bring them here when I find them? Yes, please. Just put them in the hole in front of me, and I can guard them properly. Sure thing, Big Potato. You're the best, Little Potato. You know what? Oh! Well, there's one already. Okay, there's one. Oh, you can sleep in the doghouse. <laughs> All right. Um, let's check up here. Oh, wait, we can also check. Anything here? No. Ah, oh, I gotta be really careful. Use your energy wisely. Yep. Or this might not even be the right way to get up. I mean, IVs are made for climbing. Are those chimes in the game? Yes. Okay, just making sure I wasn't going crazy. Oh, oh, I almost had it. Okay, I think I'm on the right track with... But yeah, no, the chimes are coming from the spots where you're able to nap. Smashing all of these. Come on, get in there. Come on, get in. There we go. All right, now I need to get the third. Which...
All right, let's see if you can give me a hint. <laughs> you doing okay, yeah. Star? I've been home for a while. I just, it's just my friend called me. Road, you know the situation particular of the situation that I don't mention situation. Yes. My friend just called me and she's like, pick out some clothes. And she just bought me a whole bunch of new work cl uh, like clothes for work. Hey, let's go. I was like, I, 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 she's like, did you say you want some? I was like, yeah, but, but I can wait. She's like, no, nah, no, nah, I'll get you them. She's going to order them on Monday. Yo. And, then she, it, and she sent it directly to my house. I was like. <laughs> That's awesome, though. Well, she oh, said she wanted, she said she wanted to pay me back for all the times that I've helped her out. But I'm like, OK, but you don't have to do it with clothes. <laughs> Clothes are expensive. But they will do it anyway because they like you. They did do it anyway, and and <laughs> and now yeah. the club will be arriving soon. Nice. And How much is it though? She's like, no. Because yeah, but if I'm if they t if they say the price, you're gonna try and uh, repay. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So they, they're smart by not telling you the price. Ah, <laughs> uh, you fool. Oh, he is right. His 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 ultra special tennis balls are different. How the yeah. fuck they get yeah. those places though? <laughs> uh, Tanuki. The, well, the no, in no, the, no. The, the so, invention of the Tanuki. Yeah, the, the invention of the Tanuki. Tanuki made a, an invention for the Shiba here so that when the Shiba's, do yeah, uh, the Shiba's the owner was out... He could basically play fetch without his owner being home. Yes. So and then the I machine malfunctioned. an automatic pitching machine. You know, the thing they use for tennis. Yes. Yeah. This is... You Don't did it, little potato. Thank you. Thank you. As a reward, here is an official little potato costume. An official little potato. <laughs> wear it. Wear it, you fuck it. Do you wear it? Nope. No, 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 the no. The no. cat wearing dog costume. You know, I'd be more impressed if it was a cat wearing cat costume. Oh my god. Yeah. Look at <laughs> Wait, does that make you an honorary dog? Yes. It has the whiskers and everything. <laughs> well, the, the the whiskers that are coming out from the... are just the other whiskers from the cat. Shut the fuck up. It has whiskers. Cat is now doggo. Cat is now doggo, Florg says. You... That's Tanuki, I'm guessing? Yes, this is the Tanuki. The new cat dog. This portal is on the pet work, but I need a feather to power it up. Got any? Yes, but I want to keep it. I want to spore. Actually, it's getting close to midnight. I mean, it's one minute off. Yeah, yeah but, but it normally it takes me a bit to do my more, outro stuff. Like what happened last time... Where he was 15 minutes ahead, and he's like, oh, it's, it's 15 past midnight. We're like, huh? Eastern Eastern time zone confusion? Fucking confusing everyone in chat. We're like, see, look, it's already midnight. Look, that was also a VR chat thing. My brain w looked at the numbers, thought it was saying midnight 15, when in reality it was just saying that I had been in that world midnight, for 15 sorry, minutes. Did you see midnight 15? Yes. Oh my god. Look, you know what I what I'm referring to. <laughs> I know, but road uh, uh, Would you rather I say twelve fifteen AM? Thank you! Thank you <laughs> Be there, proper Honestly I wouldn't I wouldn't even go to say uh, twelve at midnight. I'd say it's just zero. <laughs> zero AM.
That is also acceptable. Yeah. Alright. God, I really want to watch Nowhere King. I really want to watch Centaur World now. Ah, uh, Centaur World. The Nowhere King is a very good villain. All right. Oh, yeah. I introduced Road to... Um... Centaur World? Yeah, one Not of the songs Centaur from World, it specifically. Like the the, 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 the nowhere, nowhere King. The, yes. the song? Oh, no, Wait, 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 I have to show you something. I gotta share, I gotta well, share my screen with can, you. Can I do my outro and have us read out? Hey, this is really quick, please. Ah. please. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to mute y'all on stream so that people can't hear you. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> like I said, it was really quick. Now you can do your outro. Your yeah. Final. All right. I'm not sure if I want to raid out to Lexi with her event or if I want to raid out to somebody else. I I have someone I want to go to to show support, but I don't have the points. to <laughs> Have fun. Mm. Honestly, I might start doing commissions just to get money for the dog. Oh, everything okay? Uh, well, uh, as I said, this Tuesday, he's going to go get his operation. He's going right. to get spicy. But I, in the next month, I'm going to have to pay 400 to start his training. And that's going to be two, uh, 280 monthly wow keep Ooh. training until like five six months is it specific and... training or can we train him at home listen uh it's gonna be training in any way i've for this boy though it's gonna be training for him to listen to me because i'll be moving an apartment uh at the first chance I get. And for that to reassure people around me that he's a good boy, I need him trained. Mm. And uh, Balls Away is going to be a bit helpful to that. Not only that, but he won't be making any puppies anytime soon. And he, uh, as, as well as could help uh, his life expectancy. Yeah. Or so as special, so or so people say. KC's live. So yeah. Oh. That be how it be. I'm assuming that's who you're wanting us to raid out to. Yeah, because like I don't want the points to read to either. Hello. I was like, eh, Back eh, from that. Eh, you you <laughs> know what? I will give you an an, an honorary one here. <laughs> okay, so. Let's get the raid message. Here's the version for passersby. Here is the version for followers. Here's the version for subscribers. Let me get this set up. Let me get music going. All right. So let's get the raid out and let me actually first before we go see what they're streaming and what they're doing. Warbrain! Ooh, okay. They're doing Warframe. Neat. Yeah. Okay, yeah, let's go give them some support. I'm kind of curious on this. 
All right. She is very good and funny and sweet, and she just needs encouragement from now, from every now and then, because she's very, very good. Yeah. All right. Well, let's go give her some love and support then. So let's go give a hello to KC Live. Do you know that while this is the end of stream, this is not the end of our time together, and so Road the Desk will always be open for another adventure. Thank you all so, so much for sticking around. Please have a wonderful rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is in your time zone, as we say. Bye-bye! And remember to refresh! <laughs>